Welcome back to The Big Money Show. I'm Jackie DeAngelis, live at the AI Summit here in New York City. Let me tell you, we've seen some incredible technologies and how they're going to interact with everyday people in their lives. It absolutely is mind-blowing, and we're going to bring you one of the ones that we looked at today. Standing here with me right now, Dr. William Berry. So good to be with you. I want to get this right. Professor, Emerging Technologies, Government Contractor at Army War College, Senior Counsel, Task Force Lima, out of the Pentagon, that's the caliber person that you are that we're dealing with. And, and you're working with some avatars here um, who are basically gathering information, can do a lot of work for us. Tell me about it. Jackie, so what's really interesting about these is it's augmented intelligence, right? We talk about artificial intelligence, right? And there's nothing artificial about this. It's to augment your intelligence. So what you see in the background is like this, this discussion today. I was a keynote this morning. Mm -hmm. These are all the discussions that we had. So at the end of the day, I take this information and I make it small and I just put that into Tim's head, and then he knows it for the day. Okay. So he's built on conversations. Okay. So those conversations are the source. So if we read a book, we go find the author and say, the author, can we interview you about your book? And then we record the conversation with the book. All right, so we're gonna test it out. This one is Timmy, that one is Tim. They have studied very hard. And I wanna ask Timmy what Ready? he knows about me. Timmy, what do you know about Jackie DeAngelis and my skill set? Let's go here, hold on, Timmy was getting ready. Go ahead, All right. Now. Timmy, what do you know about me, Jackie DeAngelis, and my skill set? Let me think about that. That's a good idea, Tim. You should think about that. Dr. Barry, based on my research and understanding, you are a professor with expertise in areas such as philosophy, oh, international no. humanity. <laughs> He's talking about <laughs> oh, me. Oh, no, Tim. But Tim, we're asking about Jackie DeAngelis and you being a human machine team with her. What are Jackie DeAngelis' strengths and how could you help her? I think he thought you were me. I'm considering that. Well, I appreciate that. Jackie DeAngelis' strengths lie in her expertise in finance and journalism, <laughs> as well as her fluency in multiple languages. Farsi, right? So. As her advisor, I could enhance these strengths by providing her with strategic advice and insights in these areas, as well as helping her stay up to date with the latest developments and updates through my access to vetted source material. Okay, this is really interesting because he's talking about how he could work with me to enhance the skills that I already have, which he's done research on. This is collaborative AI. Yes, and so... Of course. Timmy was listening as you were talking. So, you see how the Absolutely. brain it moved around a little bit? I can continuously monitor and update Jackie on any relevant developments in her field through my access to vetted source material. So you'd ask for your vetted sources right. that you this give it. This will ensure that she stays informed and up to date in her reporting. So it's constantly going to update you based on what you told it to go. So the vetted sources you trained it on, it would say, I'm only going to go to those sources. So if it's in Farsi, I know mm -hmm. that these are the sources that I want. So while you're working on this case, these guys could be your team. Right. That's waiting for you. And there's a huge concern about bias when yes. you're using AI, right? You don't know what the sourcing is. So this is a way to control that, to basically say, take these kinds of sources out um, and, and essentially direct the avatar and their mind in the direction that you want to go, because that'll help you the most. Correct. So the information that just came out, if we ask it, which we don't have time to, it will tell you this article is from Jackie when she talked about the Obama um, dialogue. This is mm -hmm. from Jackie's article out of Bergen County. Timmy would talk about other articles that I read about you. So it goes through and tells you what article did it come from, what's the factuality rating for it, yeah. what makes Fox Business an interesting, different channel. So all that's in here. So everything goes back to a source, which is really fascinating, but the bias is the ethics. Right. These ethics are based on rule and act utilitarianism, which is the greatest good. And what is the greatest good? That's where discrimination comes in. Yeah. Who's gonna decide that? So right now, myself and a small team of us we work together and we raise our hand and say, we made that decision, right? And so what we do is we need, to, we need to spread out, right? So we need as many people from as many different religious faiths, as many different cultural um, like people. Backgrounds, from, Yeah. Right. So that's, but that's, that's a tremendous weight on your shoulders. I mean, that, that really is a lot. Um, Dr. Barry, this is incredible. I think they were a little nervous, <laughs> but it was great to have you <laughs> and great to have, to have Timmy Thank you, Jackie. and Tim as well. For Thank sure. you so Thank much. Thank you very much. Um, and so when we're bringing it all together, we're also thinking about how these um, machines basically are gathering this kind of in information and they're becoming smarter every day, guys, because they'll do work and then they'll build on it. And the next day they get to store that information, unlike us who, you know, are apt to forget things from time to time. They're able to keep track of it. And so basically you just have a huge dictionary um, of information and material 
material mm. right at your fingertips and you're disposable. Brian, I think it's pretty interesting. I think it is, too. I think you should go get a cup of coffee with Timmy because he really wants to get to know you, Jackie. We'll, we'll check in with you in just a bit. Thanks for that. Okay.